pleasure is mine. It's all mine. I feel like oftentimes you don't really want like this stuff too early because you want cards like Barista to duplicate it, but I think if I have the Miscreant, I could do Coin Miscreant and then play from there. Be water rogue at the novice. Could also be a poker mirror. It's pogo. Okay, so we got Myra's. Do I ever just go dump my hand, prep Myra's, and then go Pogo, Recruiter, Recruiter? I think that's the line. I could go Snip Snap here into like double Lackey Hero Power or something. How did I dump my hand? That's the way to dump it, right? This might be more tempo. I wonder if you use that pogo as like some kind of tempo play to make me play off curve or something, I'm not sure. Hey Strive Crow, cheers Andrew, hello. How's it going? Thanks for the bits, Goosey. Okay, <laughs> I got the sap. Prep sap, even. If we prep sap, what can we do? Nothing. But there's no point in holding the prep. That's my last spell.
I developed the one mana here. I have to save it because if I don't lab recruiter it, it's my last pogo. Oh, did I make a mistake? I should put the pogo first, then trade in because you're the bat. Right, because it, it could buff the pogo. I, I think it might have even done it. I don't remember what order it was. We have no Zilliac, so we have no healing. Oh, I'm playing so I keep forgetting about this bat. No punish. I think we go bigger and faster because we always draw pogos and he might not. To go pogo barista pogo, that's pretty big. Wait, we shouldn't do this mistake again for bat. Although we do want to draw the novice too, right? Or plus one plus one earlier. It's not always on a unit we play. I have small units, so even against Zilliax, I can trade in for the Divine Shield and trade a bigger Pogo in. But, so I like leaving this guy up over the small guys. I think if our biggest minion was... Because this is our smallest minion, right? We can't dagger the Divine Shield, obviously. But we have a kind of a semi-small minion to trade into it. Oh yeah, decks are not submitted. Do I have a recruiter, the the barista, with the second recruiter? I think it's better because it draws me. I want you and you and you. I want you and you and you. I need space, that's why I'm doing these bad trades. It's still the same lethal clock, and if he vanishes then my board's still insane because of all the pogos. Yeah, decks aren't submitted. There's no way he wins this even healing the full. I need to find a barista.
want space. I want more live recruiters. <laughs> Step right up. I got one more. It's like I'm going infinite with this Barista Lab Recruiter Pogo Hopper combo. Oh, that Myra's was sick. GG's dude, it's an honor to get my ass kicked by you. That's hoping I would find out in Mars. <laughs> yeah, I had a sick uh sick draw there. I was able to make my deck basically perfect, right? After the Mars. I'm gonna keep backstab. Maybe I'll activate Miscreant with it. Pilfer. Insane building. I didn't make this deck. I just copied it from Bunny Helper and Casey, the European GMs who play this deck. I probably want to save the fan for the miscreant stuff. So I could like backstab Edwin. Four four. Hmm. What if I Edwin step the next turn? Get a huge one. It's so obvious too. All the ways he's gonna do is gonna prep blood the board right, and then I go fan backstab backstab. Edwin. I don't mind this play a lot, especially with Myers in my hand. Just go all in next turn to have Myers. The fan is better than Shiv, technically. About to leave up a miscreant. Which is pretty bad. Especially with the lackeys, right? Like witchy lackey. Is a pilfer spell? No, Blink Fox. So two Ram Rogue cards. Definitely kind of like Jazz steps there for this one screen too. Oh, uh, then we pick up a Lab Recruiter. So might be worth it to just Myra's. I hope he's trying to find Sap and not playing his own Van Cleef here. I think though his own Van Cleef would be worse for me. Uh oh, it's a Van Cleef. Oh no. It's even worse for me. Oh, okay, okay, never mind. No Van Cleef. Nice, light will, but pretty bad. Think we can find it in seven? We might have to. What is this hand? Two ram one ram road card, one more no more lackeys? 
spell, discovered spell, and ran rogue card. Hmm. Because that could also go Shiv Novice. I think it's slow. I think it's going to take the draw seven. Got Barista. Pogo, nice. Oh, good, perfect. No Zilliax. The thing is, if we found another Miscreant, a second Miscreant, we can also go Miscreant uh, Lab Recruiter and try to play like that too. I think it's not only Pogo. It's possible that we beat a Rogue just by spamming Miscreants, I believe. I wonder if we shadow step, if we should shadow step the recruiter or Pogo, because we can also do what we did last game with the Pogo barista combo re recruiter. I have a lot of draw. And because he's ahead on tempo, there's no guarantee that my recruiter survives. I think I might need to have two. I can't dagger. Dagger's better tempo than Shiv because I can do two. But the thing is, next turn I want to go Pogo Pogo Barista for seven mana. So I I need to, to take an extra draw from Shiv here. Pogo Pogo Barista is very strong. Is that even activated? Oh, because of Burglar. Yeah. I am kind of like, I need to win the board. It's a tempo matchup because I have no healing, right? I definitely need to like kill him. Oh, I don't need to push damage. I just need to create board states that's very high attack, right? Because I can just one shot him. Okay, he only pushes four here. And he only has seven attack. This is actually pretty reasonable. Could have gone worse, right? Actually, can I make a better play than Pogo Pogo Barista? Because I, I can have Shiv. Actually, yeah, yeah. Maybe I messed up last turn, I should have daggered then, because I don't think this play is even the best the more I look at this. Repentance? It's possible, right?
holding the recruiter, get back with Brissa. Um, well, I'll start taking fatigue and losing draws if I don't I did, if I didn't play the recruiter the first turn after our Mars, right? So I, I th think that's excessive. Oh, after the shadow step. I didn't even have time to play Brista so far. It, did, it would seem like it was bad because I would have to lose tempo playing the Brista. I actually planned to play Brista turn seven, but I didn't. So I think we're both wrong. I think six is enough regardless, but yeah. I was wrong in the sense that I should never plan to play Burst to turn seven. It's really about tempo, and your play is even less tempo. And my original play is not the max tempo either, so tempo is the most important resource here. Oh, is this a huge Van Cleef? I hope I can trade into it with these. Oh no, I have to trade a 9 9 and a 7 7 for it. Technically, I can miss Korean. Is that worth it, though? Because I almost think it's just like Pogo, Pogo, Barista, Pogo. And then we can just one-shot him next turn. I don't think we rely on this miscreant. Because even though I only need two damage, because I trade one, one, nine, nine, and two damage, it's not guaranteed. Ah, oh, the rush works, too. Oh no. Wait, what am I doing? How to play that turn as badly as possible. You know what? Like, I probably should never have gone for Miscreant because there's no reason for me to, right? I could just set up for 30 in one turn and double traded as bad as that is. Like, I don't need to push 10 that turn. There's no difference from him being at 30 and 20 if I have three more pogos. So 14, uh, 24, 27, no, no lethal here. I'll start taking fatigue the turn after. I can brisk the miscreant back maybe as well. But I need to play as safe as possible. And now I didn't kill him this turn, so I now might die next turn. What can I get with Miscreant? Nothing, right? I might as well go for a big pogo. Let me see if I get taunts. I 
I don't even know if I really like this. Because now I don't have space. I could have suicided the miscreant. On his 4-1, I believe. That would have given me one more space for Pogo. Because technically his Saps won here. I might not have lethal. It's 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 32. So I do, but it's, it's getting close. Very close through one Sap. Doomsayer, hmm. There's way more taunts than Doomsayers, but... <laughs> that's all. So, that's not gonna save him. There's no way that's gonna save him. I already explained the summoner, it was because of the taunt. But I also explained that it's probably not the right move. 